Okay, the first part of Retro Tech this week, we're going to show the little like one minute video of the DOS computer, and then we'll we'll step through and, and Lady Ada can tell you about some of the interesting pieces. How late later was this? This is a laptop with an 8088, 8086 processor inside. It takes about a minute to boot, so let's let it boot while we take a look what's going on here. So we've got like a 800 by 480 display here. It's an active TFT, uh, although it's a little dim. There's a hack for updating it for brightness. You can say hi, it's yes. Um, I got the version with the OPL3 Yamaha chip, so I'll find some software that uses um, this cool like sound card. Over here, uh, there's a slot for an 8087 uh, floating point unit. Um, and then um, there's a USB port. The USB port goes through a CH347 uh, USB to 8080 um, parallel interface. So this has a 512 megabyte SD card, um, and that does actually show up on the disk drive. So I was able to transfer some files over. And uh, yeah, I've got like a little running DOS machine. It's really cute. Okay. So we took some really nice photos. Uh, you can see the kind of translucent um, front. And then um, these are those, you know, older components that you're talking about. Yeah, it's just like, um, I don't remember what all these are, but like some of them are, like the 8087 is an FPU that you can get. And then over here, there's this like Yamaha OPL, I guess this is a soundboard, I'm assuming, or like it has little musical notes. So it's like an audio or MIDI, MIDI generator. Um, by default, it just beeps, right? It doesn't have like any way to make musical tones. So, um, yeah, interesting stuff. You can see the keyboard, obviously, the modern keyboard has like the Windows logo on it. Mm. And then uh, here's the bottom. This is where I think. Yeah, this is like the graphical system. And it has some text I can't, you know, call off the top of my head, but it's like the VGA generator and I think like the clock, the RTC, all that stuff um, is, uh, is on the bottom there. And then there's a, uh, big battery on the right the lower right that's a four amp hour lithium battery and this thing it's not meant to run on a battery so that at four amp hour battery is, is pretty chunky it doesn't i think it runs for like a half an hour yeah here it is close book 8088 and then uh we decided to toss it on here to um show off it's, it's cool it's very sharp, square, glory. Yeah. All right. And that is uh, Rich for this week.